dad had always had wild animals in our backyard. I thought it was just a normal thing. <laughs> but you looked out of our family room window and there you looked into an eagle area where we had golden eagles who were on loan from the LA Zoo in a breeding program. And we always had wild animals of all sorts and other, being in the wild animal business and movies and all that. So we had, you know, lots of friends that were involved in the movie business and us involved in the movie business. So uh, when he decided to move to Grants Pass, of course, with eagles with you and everything, you have to get permits to go across state lines or you mm. violate something called the Lacey Act. Huh. So he got his permits to come into Oregon with the eagles and other animals. And when he did, of course, these permits come across the desk of the local sheriff and the state police and the uh, Oregon Department of Fish and Wildlife and all these other agencies. And they said, well, this is sort of strange. Let's go check this guy out. So they came out and met my father. And he was one of these guys, bigger than life, a big booming voice, and a thousand stories. <laughs> um, so they said, boy, next time we get an injured animal, let's just haul it out to that guy. Because up until that time, the animals were just dispatched. Anything that was found injured was just dispatched, and that was the end of it. Nobody took care of them. Um, started off innocently enough with a you know, nest of jays, and then maybe a baby raccoon, and a this and that. And this was like in 1974. And um, by 1981, this thing had become such an unwieldy beast. He decided, I, I need to form a nonprofit uh, because I can't support this any longer. It's getting too much larger. And he hated the idea of being having a nonprofit because he was an autocrat. And the idea of having to take directions from a board of directors just horrified him. He hated that idea. <laughs> um, so anyway, he did it anyway. Um, jumped in and in 1981 formed what is now today called Wildlife Images. For full conversations and future content, please subscribe at grantspassvip.com.